na kutuharibia mali yetu wameharibu bibi zetu wametunyang'anya masimu wametuumiza ile kabisa sasa mimi nataka kusema hivi hii serikali ya Kenya kwanza ndio tulipigania i'm one of the chief campaign campaigners of Kenya kwanza government I'm among the very first people that started selling and campaigning for His Excellency William Ruto. Truly, I wasn't campaigning to be repaid like this. I wasn't campaigning for land grabbers to come and start claiming that our church properties are their properties. We cannot lose properties in this country. Na wame ni wengi, wamekuja wanasema ni NIS, wengine wanasema ni DCIO, wengine ni polisi ni wengi. So definitely government is in hope. And it, it is sad, very sad, that this is the government that we campaigned for. I'm yet to believe that they can do this to me. I'm the one who sold Kenya Kwanza, UDA, in Nairobi County. I'm the one who gave them a platform. Leave alone that. I'm the one who gave them a vision for Nairobi. And today, look at what we are suffering. Ukingia ukundani kumeja police and they are all armed. Wametunyang'anya vitu zetu, wamechukua simu, wametupiga. Me I have to go to hospital. Sasa hivi nimekunywa pain killers ndio nifike hapa. So I go have to rush to hospital. Kujaribu kuona vile nitatibiwa miguu na mikono. It, it is sad. It is very very sad. Pengine tuombeshe wakuweza tueleza wamekubainia kini hasa cha kuwa. Hapana, hakuna mtu anatuambia wanafanya nini, wanasema tu wametumwa na MD wa railways. Na MD wa railways ajue. Hapa hakuna property ya railways. Na MD wa railways ajue. Kuna Mungu mbinguni. Bila mnasemanga nyinyi kwa serikali kuna Mungu mbinguni. Hata kwetu kwa makanisa kuna Mungu mbinguni. If anybody in Kenya kwanza government can dare touch my properties. Je, na wale raia wenye hawana mtu wa kuwasaidia? Wale raia wenye hawana mwenyewe. If Jesus is alive ministries is under attack today. How about the common mwananchi? Tutahamia wapi? Tutaenda wapi? Serikali yetu yenyewe ndio inatupiga. Where are we going to go? Where are we going to run? Mimi mwenyewe nimesalimia watu wa DCIO hapa nikawaambia karibuni mtuokolee. Kumbe they are coming to reinforce their NIS brothers. Alafu wakaitaka wengine. So you can really see tumefika place where rest. Sisi ndio hatuna mtu wa kutusaidia na mahali ya kukimbilia. Lakini kuna Mungu mbinguni. Wacha tuone wamebomoa huko nyuma kuna ukuta wanabomoa huko hata saa hii waimesimamiwa wanabomoa wamebomoa wabomea huko na walikuwa wamekuja tena tarehe kumi mwezi wa februari wakaanza kubomoa from hapa from the start sasa nasi tulikuwa na harusi kanisa ilikuwa imejaa watu the wall that you are mentioning pengine bishop is it the same wall that you moved to yes it is the, it is the same wall and it is the same wall that they had demolished actually demolished my wall to put their wall so now they are coming to demolish again and it is because the court case is coming up so they are trying to protect themselves ati wajafunga jia unajua jaji hapo ya kuona amerudi nini so they are coming out they are trying to cover up themselves which one to one hata bimbuni kuna sheria wacha duniani hata bimbuni kuna sheria hey guys i have to go to i have to go to hospital mheshimiwa mwago is here with us mmekuja hapa leo and this attack has happened in Chiyaku. I've been a member of this church to call it Koko Tokudoku. And there have never been any land issue. So, we find out the truth. These guys have come, invaded this place. They don't have any court order, they don't have any eviction. They have nothing. They are just claiming they are under orders from above. And it is good that they have admitted. There is a force behind it. MD Mainga, it's a person that office yake kwa hapa less than 200 meters ni mtu mwenye anajua bishop for a very long time alikuwa anafaa kuja hapa atuambie kinaganaga atuambie but you can see there is another force yenye iko nyuma yenye anataka kula kugrabisha shamba yenye iko hapa and there's nothing short of that kwa sababu wezi ingia kwa shamba ya mtu bila ene na hii kuna kesi hadi kotini even the respect for the rule of law it is lacking in this administration ili ile serikali yenye sisi tulisema ndo na matokeo yake and you can see what they are doing if you are pressing even their biggest campaigners you can only imagine what they are doing with us with the taxes and everything anu watu wenye wana huruma na sisi na sisi tunasema hivi kama mtu amefika mahali mpaka na grab shamba ya kanisa huyo that's not a human being and we are going to deal with them kwa sababu hii Kenya pia inatawaliwa na sheria na wezi tuambia there's nobody above the law we are not going to take this like down we are going to take get to the bottom of this matter 
Kwa sababu kikubali na sasa wale wanyonge. Eh wale hawana mtu wa kutetea. Eh, hii kanisa nyinyi wote mnajua imekuwa kwa miaka mingi sana. Kama sasa hizo wameanza kuinvade hapa. Na sasa wakianza kutafuta wale watu wengine. Sisi hatutakubali. You could maybe elaborate and make it clear. Is the church on leave? Is it no, on no, no. rent? No, 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 no. What is the church? We have our title deeds, my dear. This is our property we bought. We have title deeds. We have no debt. We owe no money. That property is ours. This is property is ours. We even have a approvals yes. to build a twin tower. Yes. From the county government, from all the... the, the our properties are even under construction yeah. as it is. You can see this is under construction. Yes. We are building a twin tower that is going So it's something that we may approve by all state agencies. So, Imam Bia Kukirab Chamba, Lord Kapali. Na hii ni kitu enye tutapika nao kwa court, tutapika nao kwa kanisa hadi tupate our right. Kora one wa waishu ratu hatu na nila reka, ni hatu ikuwe nae ratu hatu. 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 Ni hatu ik Ati rono ni wakari atau kampai ni ada untuk mana pun dia tu ke hotel apa saja itu ni orang ni ratu tuhnya itu si itu ni ratu tuhnya beroti si itu for real mana dia teki ya mana mereka itu orang yang mana itu mana itu ni mana seria ni ni wakai ni aku nak seria katika ini je so let us fight it out legally mana bila mana sema mana tuan dia apa property area ni gani apa mana property area ni baru kali baru kali ni 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 investors wenye wame jinun dia property sana what is the next move? Have they given you a verdict? Have they come in no. back? Have they told they, you they to have not said anything. anything? No, they have not said anything. They have actually pushed us by beating us. They have to go to the hospital. They have broken our legs, they have broken our hands, they have taken our phones, they have taken our money, they have taken our car keys. Even as it is, I have to look for somebody to take me to hospital. They have taken our car keys. But you given notice that they are no. coming to me? No notice, no court order, nothing, absolutely nothing. It is not a proper land grabbing. Lakini mesmanua na nani? Na maaskari. So you can imagine.